this video we're going to work out an individual integral. It's going to be a typical u substitution integral that's most commonly going to be found in a Calc 1 class. All right, I do have up here um, a Pythagorean identity here, 1 plus cotangent squared x equals cosecant squared x. All right, um, so anytime you've got a given Pythagorean identity like this, you can solve and manipulate it. So we are ultimately going to be using this. We're going to subtract 1 from both sides because as you can see in this integral, I've got the cotangent squared of 3x. Okay, so we're going to want to make a trig substitution before we start this integral. All right, so we're going to rewrite this as cosecant squared of 3x minus 1, all right, and then dx. All right, now from here, I'm going to do my basic u substitution. I'm going to let this inside portion of this function be my u, so I'm going to let u equal 3x. All right, from here, I'm going to take the derivative of both sides, so I'll have a du is equal to a 3dx. I'm going to go ahead and solve all the way down for dx, so I'm going to have a du over 3 is equal to dx. All right, now from there, I'm going to come back up to this original integral, and I'm going to start making some substitutions. So we're going to have the integral cosecant squared. I'm going to replace the 3x with the u. All right, minus 1. All right, now I'm going to replace dx with exactly what it equals. All right, so I'll have a du over a 3. All right, now keep in mind that is all one <clears throat> expression right there. On this next step, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull out this 1 third out in front, and then I'm going to break this up into two separate integrals. Okay, so I'm going to have a 1 third pulled out in front. Then I'm going to break this up into two separate integrals, so I'll have the integral of a cosecant squared u du minus the integral of a 1 du. All right, now what that's going to allow me to do here, hopefully this, at this point, if you are in a Calc 1 class and you're working with integrals, this should be memorized as the negative cotangent u. All right, and we integrate 1 with respect to u there is going to be just a straight u. So on my next step, I'm going to have a 1 third. All right, integrating here, negative cotangent u minus integrating here a u. I've now fully integrated, so plus c, and I can replace my u's with the 3x here. So I'll have the 1 third is equal to a negative cotangent of 3x minus a 3x and then plus c. All right, and then to clean this up a little bit further, I would probably go ahead and distribute that 1 third, making it a negative 1 third cotangent 3x minus, taking that 1 third times that 3 there will just give me the x and then plus c. So definitely a straightforward u substitution integral typically found in Calc 1 class. It does involve knowing some trig identities so that you can make those substitutions to make it a little bit simpler. All right, and then breaking up something like this, um, you wouldn't necessarily have to break that up into integrals like I did, but just kind of trying to show all the steps for that beginning Calc 1 student. Definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends so they can benefit too. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.